a literal living heirloom that continues to give one Hastings man lots of joy celebrating his family roots. Our Lauren Bentley shares more on this week's Show Us Something Good. I just kind of water it when I think about it. Like most people, John Baumvalk likes a low maintenance plant. It's a very easy plant to grow, at least has been for me. And he sure did look out with this one. It's an Amazon lily that's grown to be tough through more than 100 years of blooming. Its ancestors were originally my great grandfathers, probably from about 1915, somewhere in that era. It's a relic that remains alive and well in his home in Hastings. Then when my grandmother went into a retirement home, it came into my parents' family and my parents had it for several decades and then I've had it for probably 20 years or so. Though he doesn't know why the plant has stuck around for so long. Why was this a special plant to keep? I have no idea what the origin and why originally. He keeps it in a happy place facing a south window as a sentimental staple in his home. My daughter and my nieces and nephews, they grew up with it in my parents' house, and it was always called the Gagi Lily because that was what they called my mom. And it generally blooms mid-December around her birthday. So it was always kind of sweet that it was the Gagi Lily and um, bloomed for her birthday. And it reminds him of his family's past and now their future as he continues the legacy of the Gagi Lily. And so I think this represents a, a physical, tangible thing that ties me to three generations back. I think that's pretty amazing that this plant was raised by my great-grandfather in his greenhouse and uh, then has just been handed down the generations to me and now to my nieces, to two of my nieces.